Hello everyone, welcome back once again. This is Lamin Sani of LX Web Apps. And in this video, we're going to be checking for if a file exists or a directory exists or if something is a file or whether it's a directory, okay? So first of all, let's check that if something is a file. So let's go back in our htdocs um, base folder. So we have this file here, index.html, and we have this folder, some folder. We're gonna be checking if this file here is a folder or is a file. So let's first check whether it's a file so we'll do echo um, is file so that's the function that you call to check if something is a file is the is file uh, function then you have to pass it the name of whatever you're checking in this case um, index.html so back in our browser when you refresh we should get the number one or true okay so if you remember the number one is uh, basically sometimes PHP returns that for you instead of the um, true okay so it means the same so next let's check whether this is a folder so there's a function called is directory is dir so um, back here refresh and nothing occurs so basically it's false so we have nothing okay so next let's check whether this folder here is a directory some folder so um, we're gonna pass that name here some folder okay Back in our browser, refresh. As you can see, we have one because that is actually a folder. So let's check whether that is a file. So let's say is file. Back in our browser, refresh. As you can see, nothing gets printed out because that is actually not a file. So next, let's check whether um file exists or directory exists. So there's a function called file exists. You can use it to check for existence of files or directories, both, works for both. So uh, when we say file exists, we pass in that directory name, go back in our browser, refresh, as you can see, returns true for us, in this case, one. So let's pass in index.html, go back in the browser, refresh, it still brings us true because that file also exists. So just remember, it checks for both files and directories. Okay, so next let's pass in something that doesn't exist. Let's say index2.html. Back in the browser, refresh. As you can see, nothing gets printed to the screen because that file does not exist. Okay, so um, that brings us to this video here where we checked for existence of files or whether something is a file or it's a directory or folder. So I thank you for watching. I will see you soon in another video. Cheers. Bye-bye.